All right, you two. So this is the main unit of the Philips uh, 5.1 home theater that you have seen before, and uh, that's it. So today I'm gonna open it up and gonna see what's inside of it. Well, I'm not gonna mess up with the front panel and all that stuff here because it's a new one. And if I open this, try to open this, this will leave a mark here on this cabinet. So I'm not going to do that. I'm going to open this up from the back side and going to show you the uh, subwoofer here and the speaker here. You can see, you can uh, clearly see the speaker because there is no mesh or grills at the front. And uh, this thing cannot be opened from the back side. So if you want to open it up. You gotta go through the front panel, you need to remove this front panel, then you can uh, clearly see the speaker driver. So that's why I'm not gonna open it up. Well, this would be 3 to 5 watt RMS uh, speaker driver, so uh, nothing big in that. So the important thing is the subwoofer, so let's open this thing and let's see what's inside of it. Oh wow, well that was so easy, you can see this is the 8 inch driver which uh, looks very nice and uh, four holes are there to mount this cover, you can see, so that's it. Well, I'll open the back panel and let's see. Alright, so I've opened it up and uh, you can see this is the back side of the kit. There is an IC here and uh, some uh, SMD components are on this side. And this is a quite a big transformer. And uh, let's check uh, the Specs here to 30 volt 50 hertz input, and the output is 12 volt 2.8 ampere, 13 volt 2.8 ampere, and 10.5 volt 0.3 ampere. Yeah. So that's it, and uh, on this side, you can see. Those are the transistors over there mounted to the heat sink. You can see, and uh, on this side, this is the rectifier kit here 4700 MFD, 35 volt. Two big capacitors are there, and two smalls are there. So, and the heat sink is quite big. You can see and uh, uh, if you look inside that's the air pipe on the right side so Sorry, on the left side, if you uh, see it from the front side, so we're at the back, that's why it's on the right side, and that's the speaker. And magnet is uh, quite a bit good. And let's try to 
see the specs if it's written on there. Well, that's a 60 watt and 8 ohms speaker, I guess. And there is a MHD circuit board, you can see. So that's it. That's what's inside of this Philips 5.1 home theater main unit. So if you're gonna like the video, if you like it, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.